Every year we give out something called the Legend Award, and it's uh, to honor, you know, a person or an organization who has made a major contribution to the traditional music culture in Southern California. So this year's award is actually in honor of someone who's not right out here in the western part of L.A., but more from the eastern part of L.A., a town that I live in, known as Pasadena. So let me uh, just uh, make this a little shorter here because you're not here to see me. You want to see them, and they're going to give a few words about what they do. But this year's honor goes to the Pasadena Folk Music Society. Gentlemen, uh, we, we have a plaque. Which one of you wants to hold it? For whoever's going to take some pictures out there. Oh, by the way, there's a check that comes with this, so we'll talk about that afterwards. <laughs> well, I know some of you know who we are. Mike? Right here. This one. All right. I know some of you know who we are. We've been around for a little over 30 years putting on concerts in Pasadena. We actually tallied it up the other day and our organization has done over 360 concerts so far. And we're working on some more. The whole idea behind the series is that we try to bring new music to established fans and new fans to established musicians. That's what it's all about. And that's why we hope you come and see some new stuff that you've never seen before. And if you come over to our booth, we might even give you a CD of somebody you've never heard before. That's what it's about, and that's why we put the time into it. Well, my name is Rex. I just want to say we're really honored. This is a great organization, and I've been coming to, to the festival for many many years and you guys just know how to do it and uh and you've been around longer than we have we feel like we've been around for a while so thank you very much for keeping us keeping it going and we all kind of work together thank you this has a special meaning for me because for many many years the Topanga Banjo Fiddle Festival was my birthday present to my father. His birthday is May the 8th, and we used to come out here on the third Sunday of May and spend the day together. He can't be with us today. He's still around, but he's no longer physically able to get out here. But uh, this one goes out to my dad, Tom Hubbard. And, uh, thank you, folks. Thank you very much. Okay, the part they've really been waiting for, uh, that picture moment here. I, I don't think they knew about this. He's saying, wow. Well, thank you so much. Yes, yeah, so any of you want to start a music organization and uh, do 30 years with it, uh, we certainly would like to encourage you. So uh, along those lines, we have uh, many thanks uh, because they started off uh, with uh, those folks that, uh, gee, uh, are any of you scientists? Well, I was actually a student at Caltech. I forgot to say, my name is Nick Smith, and I was a student at Caltech, and a grad student there after my student days started a folk music society by talking a bunch of people into believing other people were behind it. And so that's how we managed to get Stan Rogers to a concert series with no actual capital. But the series built up and got too big for the student club that it started out, which is why we had to change the name and set up a real nonprofit with real accounting and stuff like that. How many scientists are um, Well, actually, we have a lot of scientists who attend the shows, and we just happen to put on most of our shows in the auditorium of a working laboratory building. Thank you. So, well, thank you. Yes, thank you, Nick. So, give them a big hand, folks.